Uh, recently, we found out a clash of Conans, because apparently Conan O'Brien found out that Detective Conan is a thing. <sighs> Somehow, in 25 years, he had not come across Detective Conan, even though he did a Cowboy Bebop parody back in 2004, apparently. Well, it's not the first time that Conan has been mentioned on uh, on a Conan O'Brien talk show, because... Uh, uh, he he had a one of his friends had a segment where like he basically just made rants on an armchair, and what he was ranting about specifically was that um like at the time you know when uh, Detective Conan was actually on Adult Swim that um I guess apparently the the guy uh in charge of the segment like he talked about how he really liked Cowboy Bebop but I guess at the time like uh Detective Conan or Case Close as it's known here in the West like basically took its time slot. But there is no no comparison drawn between Conan the character and Conan O'Brien. No, no, yeah. That, that I mean, I was just saying that like it wasn't a Cowboy Bebop parody so much as uh, the guy was ranting about uh, Case Close in general taking over Cowboy Bebop's slot. Yeah, it was a skit. I misspoke. But, <laughs> yeah. Uh, so Conan O'Brien thinks that Conan Edogawa is a ripoff of him. And not Conan Doyle and uh, Edogawa Rampo. So he's like, oh, Gosho Ayama, I need royalties from you because you have been ripping me off. So he's like, uh, g- give me Street Trillion Yen, $27 billion in royalties. And so uh, he announced his plans to head to Hokuen Totori Prefecture, which is the birthplace of Gosho Ayama, which is also colloquially known as Conan Town. And uh, so the mayor of Hokue responded to Conan's demands and to change parts of Conan Town. Like, one of Conan's demands, aside from the royalties, is to change the Conan statue in Hokue to a statue of him. Basically, like, it's the Conan statue, but put Conan's hair, Conan O'Brien's hair on it, which is ridiculous. Photoshop thing he did. But yeah, so basically, uh, Akio Matsumoto, the mayor, he responded to Conan's request and said that, oh, sure, he'll ref- fulfill the request so long as O'Brien puts him on a route much more, gives him a walk of fame, brings 15,000 hamburgers with him. So, you know, meeting a ridiculous uh, demand with another ridiculous demand. But Conan is playing along and he's going to call Matsumoto on the bluff. And next week, he's going to apparently show up in Hokuway to claim his money. So this has been a fun little fictional feud. It's kind of nice to see Detective Conan discussed on uh, national US TV just randomly. So, yeah, uh, we'll see the conclusion of the Conan Town saga. I guess we might already have it by the time you're listening to it, but uh, it's it's a fun thing. Uh, It's kind of nice.